everyone and welcome to West Coast Thrift Journey. So on today's adventure, we're going to head into a couple of the Goodwills. The first one is located on Cornell Road in Hillsboro, Oregon. So let's get into the store and see what we can find. If you love boho and you love eclectic and you love to find bargains, well, this is definitely the video for you. The store doesn't seem to be very busy today, but I'm gonna go back to the back of the store and see what we can find right away. On the bottom of one of the end caps, I found this really gorgeous picture. I'm seeing that the price is about $10 and I'm not sure if I'm gonna get it, so I'm just gonna add it to my cart. And then I came across these salt and pepper shakers and they didn't have a price on them that I could see, but I did see that they actually had it on the inside of the napkin holder and they are $12.99. So I'm just gonna go ahead and pick those up today for resale. As I was walking along, I spotted this vase and I thought maybe I could redo it and just take all of the twine off of it. I really like the texture and the look of it, so I'm gonna add it to my cart and redo it for my own home for the fall. Now this is also where all of the baskets are located, so let's see what they have on this aisle to offer. Wow, I'm really on a roll with these salt and pepper shakers. These are $2.99. I'm gonna add these to my cart as well and see what else I can find. As you can see, I have my little shopping partner with me today and she just wants to take a quick nap. But up on the top shelf, I found this really cool vase. So on the inside, it's a clay vase or a piece of pottery. And on the outside is a wicker basket and it's priced at $3.99. So I'm gonna pick that up as well. So when I was doing my home tour, I forgot to show you guys my sink. So I actually went to the dollar store and I dumped a whole bag of these rocks into my sink. I took all of the really small, small ones out that would actually go down the drain, but that is what is inside of my sink and I just keep it real clean and it's just a really fun way to kind of just keep my sink looking just kind of different than everybody else's and I really like that. So up next, I spotted this really beautiful lamp and I just wanted to show it to you guys so you could see what it looks like. I think it's so beautiful. Isn't that just gorgeous? So up next, I'm gonna head down the art department and see what they have for some, maybe some resale or even for my own home. I did spot this really beautiful picture. I do have one that is very similar, just a lot larger on my gallery wall. And I think that Mel would really like this for maybe another spot in the house. I really thought about picking it up, but I decided to leave it behind. But I really was interested in this picture. I wanted to see how old it was. And as you look on the outside of it, it's actually only got staples on it. So I do leave that behind for someone else. And let's see what else we can find. Here is another really gorgeous piece that I really thought about getting, but I did leave this one behind as well. I'm just looking for things to resell on my new website for you guys. I'm just kind of scanning the wood department to see what else I can find. And I came across this jewelry box. Now I haven't seen one like this for quite a while. It actually has a piece that just is like a secret department compartment that's down on the bottom side of it. I do have a couple of jewelry boxes on my website for sale now. So I'm gonna leave that one behind until the other one sells. I also picked up this really cool mask. I think you guys would really enjoy picking this up on my website. So be sure to watch for that coming. As soon as you guys are done watching this video, you can hop over there and check it out at www.westcoastthriftjourney.shop. So up next, I came across these really cool salt and pepper shakers. I think someone must have had a really great collection that they donated, and I'm definitely interested in picking all of these up to put on my website, so look forward to finding these.
my granddaughter was really interested in another piece that I had and I did sell it but I'm going to go ahead and pick this one up for her. She is wanting to use it for her backs of her earrings so she doesn't misplace them and I think this is a really great deal. Gosh, what a coincidence. I actually just found one just like this and sold it on my Facebook marketplace, like really quick, just like the snap of a finger. And I actually thought about picking that one up as well as this really beautiful plate. I really liked that it was ha that it had 14 karat gold around the outside. And I really loved the plate, but it's one that you just kind of use for decorating on a wall. So I did leave that behind. I don't want to have to ship something that's quite this thin. I'm afraid it's going to break during shipping. So as soon as I turned, I spotted these foo dogs and I thought, oh my gosh, I'm so excited to find these to put on my website for you guys. I am really excited to add these to my shop. So they are salt and pepper shakers and you just shake them and the salt or the pepper comes out right under the tail. So I'm really excited to add those to my shop. So I'm gonna go ahead and check out so we can get to the next store. So be sure to leave me a comment below and let me know what you guys are loving about this video. And let's share as much as you can about this video and give me a big thumbs up. And also subscribe if you haven't yet. I'm gonna go ahead and head to the other store. We're gonna go to the store in Beaverton. So now that I'm all checked out, I'm gonna go ahead and take Olivia home to Mel so that she can take care of her. She's just really tired and needs a nap. She's just a puppy and she's just not used to our long adventures yet. But now we are going to the Goodwill over in Beaverton and I'm really excited to show you guys what I found there. This Goodwill is located on Southwest Westgate Drive in Beaverton. So let's get into the store and see what we can find. I haven't been in the store for a few days and I'm really excited to see what they have to offer. It's pretty warm outside today and really beautiful. So I think a lot of people are out just swimming and hanging out with their families, but I'm really excited to see what they have on the shelves and show you what I found. So I'm starting with the first end cap. I haven't started with the first end cap for quite a while. And while I am checking it out, I found these really cute little pictures. Now they are priced at $2 a piece. And I think that I could probably get about $5 a piece for these on my Facebook marketplace. So I'm gonna pick all of these up. They actually have bridges on all of them and I think they're really delightful. Well, it looks like they have set up for Halloween and both sides of this aisle are clearly full of stuff for Halloween. And with fall coming, the store is really getting ready for that. I found this really cute little elephant, so let's take a peek at it. It looks like this store is just fully open for Christmas as well. So we're gonna check down those aisles another day. I'm really excited to see what they have on the shelves that we like, the boho and eclectic flair. I'm really excited to see how many things that we can find today. The next item that I found for $6.99 are these cute little coasters. So there are six coasters to this set, and then you just put them on this little um, wood piece that holds them all. And I think it's so cool. I can't wait to bring that to my website for you guys as well. I don't know, tell me in a comment below whether you guys would have picked up that duck. 
Also, I think this is a voodoo doll. I don't know why they would actually put something like this on the shelf, but they did. I'm leaving this behind because I don't need any bad juju. All right, so we have finally arrived at the wood section and I'm really excited to see what they have. I found this cute little jewelry box. It is actually leather, it is not wood. I think it's really cute and I think I'm gonna add this to the, my own collection. So I'm gonna add this to my cart to take home. Now high up on the shelf, I found some really cool drums. So let's check them out. This set is $10 and the next ones are really cool as well. I think these are all hand carved and I think they are really beautiful. I'm really excited to check all of these out and I want you guys to see them as well. So while I add those two to my cart, do you guys think I made the best choice there? So also for $2.99, I found this really cool little container that is all hand carved. I'm gonna go ahead and add this to my website for you guys to pick up today. The next item in the wood section that I found is this hand carved Santa. It is only 99 cents. I'm gonna pick this up for my own Christmas tree. The next item that caught my eye is this really beautiful bell. I think this would be really beautiful during is definitely something that's going to be added to my cart. I love this fish. I think it's so adorable and it's only $5.99 and will be coming to my website for you guys to purchase today. Now this is another piece of artwork that Mel would have absolutely fell in love with. It's $6.99. I'm gonna leave it behind today and just focus on finding things that you guys would love to purchase.
Now I really fell in love with this piece. I think I'm gonna go ahead and pick this piece up. Maybe I will resell it later. I found the sticker on it and it's actually only priced at $3.99, so I think it's worth picking up today. When I find beautiful artwork that is so colorful like this, I always think that it's so worth getting and I highly recommend for you guys to look in your thrift stores and see what you can find. I also found this really beautiful piece down here on the bottom shelf. Now I think this is a little bit more of a Tuscan look maybe, but I really love the colors in it and I think it would look really beautiful in a dining room. While I was looking in the brass, I found this really cute little pot and also the cups. It comes as a set of four for only $5, so I'm gonna add these to my cart for resale. I thought this statue of this horse with this man and woman on it were absolutely gorgeous and I wanted to take a moment and show you guys. so stunning and for $19.99 I think it's well worth it but it's going to be there for someone else. So let's see what else they have on these shelves. I came across this little dish and I thought it would be really good for Mel to use on her nightstand and it's only priced at $3.99 and I think it would make a great gift. I have been selling a lot of bookends on my Facebook Marketplace, and these are only priced at $3.99, so I'm gonna pick these up and add them to my cart. Of course, I spotted another elephant, so I'm gonna add this to my own collection. While I was going through the furniture section, I found this really beautiful coffee table with um, all of these flowers and this vase all inlaid into the table. Now it's supposed to come with a sheet of glass to protect it and it didn't have it. So I did make a pass on this piece. It is priced at $49.99. So someone had 
to have left these behind. This is a really cute jewelry box and it's all in working condition. So I'm really surprised that someone just kind of left it in the furniture section. But I'm gonna go ahead and pick this up for my market, my Facebook marketplace. It's $7 and then also there is another piece that I wanna show you guys. It's absolutely gorgeous and it's priced at $7 as well. And I'm gonna actually sell these two together on my Facebook marketplace. I think it just kind of makes sense. While I was adding those to my cart, I spotted a really beautiful piece. I cannot wait to show you guys. I am so excited. I have been looking for one of these for a really long time. So this actually has really short legs that just kind of fold out. This is a portable tea table. I am really excited to show you guys this. It is only $12.99 and I will be adding this to my own home. Wow, the print on this is so gorgeous. Well guys, I'm gonna go ahead and head over to the art department and see what else I can find. I'm finding so many Asian pieces that I think that there might be some pieces in the art department, so let's go check them out. I just knew it. I had the feeling that there were going to be some more pieces of art that were more on the Asian style and I was so right. So these are kimonos that are on a very small scale. These guys are only priced at $2.99 each and there's actually another picture there on the side and I believe that this is the peace sign. So I think I'm going to go ahead and leave these behind as someone else's treasure. They are just a little too small of a scale for my wall in my dining room. They really are so cute though. Well guys, I just want to thank you guys so much for coming along on this shopping adventure today. Through two Goodwills, I had such a blast. Next time maybe we'll stop into the Christmas and the Halloween department and see what they have to offer for the fall and for the Christmas season. But until then, I'm going to go check out. Mel is barbecuing and I can't wait to eat some dinner and hang out with my family. So now that I'm checked out, I just want to say thank you guys so much and you guys have a great evening. Be sure to share, subscribe, and give me a big thumbs up.